what is going on so today is going to start a short video series maybe short maybe long term i don't know but it's going to start with this trailer of wood right here it's also got this do with this stuff too so this video is the start of our snow cone adventure and that's where i'm going to be taking all this wood i'm going to in this first video uh, is going to be the build out of the whole exterior of the building so i have all my lumber to put the entire shell together got the roofing everything so that'll be the first video which is this one so we're going to do the whole build out then we'll move on to all the next videos in the series so i'm going to have an electrical video piss off all the electricians out there a plumbing video to piss off all the plumbers out there uh and then we'll build out walls on the inside I got the ceiling gotta hang lights get everything all together bring in equipment uh everything to finish this thing out hopefully this takes me less than a month to build start to finish so that way we can have this thing up and running in july but time will tell uh i'm one person and i'm gonna have a little bit of help here and there but i gotta do the best i can to do this because i'm not gonna pay 18 19 thousand dollars is what it's costing right now for a full built out turnkey snow cone stand on a that a pull behind trailer that you still have to put equipment in and uh i'm going this route so i'm pretty handy i've already of course built out the inside of this building i watched them build it so i kind of have an idea of what to do but yeah i'm gonna wing it i have a pretty basic knowledge of how to build a building and how to do it right so i'm going to do my best i'm sure i'm going to get roasted in the comments but hey as long as it works it works right so all i got to do is pass inspections so i'm going to go ahead and start by getting all of this off of this trailer because i do have to use this trailer one more time tonight i got to go pick up my sister-in-law's car bring it over here so that way i can replace the water pump on it in between all of this job so let me go ahead and get this unloaded all right, got everything unloaded. Insulation, windows, wood, two by fours and all that over there. Flooring, roofing materials, and inside uh, ceiling materials. But unfortunately, gotta go back to the Home Depot because they shorted me three pieces of siding. So I gotta go get that, then pick up the car, then head back and then i will begin the trailer building transformation all right so this is going to kick off day two day one was filled with unloading and i had to go back and fight home depot over stuff that they missed but i got it all so we're going to start building i have the trailer leveled all four corners so i'm going to start with the floor work my way up i'm going to have the gopro run in time lapse so that way you can see that footage here All right, so got the floor laid, nailed down. Spacing's all where I need it to be. Over here. So that's where the building's going to end. And we approximately have, I believe, four foot from the building to the front of the trailer, which will house the generator, uh, trash can, other items required for the operation of the stand. So. Now, it's time to start hitting the two by fours, chopping them down, start on this back wall back here, and get that wall framed, and work our way around. All right, so we got the first wall section built, and I'll throw in a little tip. Uh, when you're cutting these, if you cut you a piece of two by four at 14 and a half inches, when you put it between, you get perfect 16 on center stud spacing I cut several of these so that way we could do uh, two at a time and you put one at the top and one at the bottom on each stud and that keeps your spacing perfect all the way down but I now have to go back to Home Depot again and uh, exchange some nails for my nailer so that way I can nail the siding onto this piece 
of wall here before we hang it on the side of the trailer over here. So I uh, will catch you in a little bit. What is going on? So it's now late. We ran around all day getting stuff for the building and pricing stuff, but works out because it's really hot already and humid. So I'm just gonna work under the big old full moon over here and my lights on the building and kind of work late through this evening where we live we're out in the middle of nowhere so we don't have a noise ordinance issue so I'm just gonna keep on working as late as I want to get this thing as much as I can done tonight so I'm a, I got the GoPro running some uh, time-lapse and then I'll have this camera cut in every once in a while but let's get building All right, so got two walls up. This one, which is the back wall, and then the front wall here. I've got my temporary braces. I've got the windows roofed in. The right, right there. And right now, I'm about to build the back wall for this area right here. And then we'll do the front wall over there. So that way we can get these walls square and sturdy. And get off these little temporary braces. So I'm moving on that. 